concept of a platform, first of all, is to provide a broad foundation uh, within which multiple activities can, can take place that are linked by some sort of an overriding theme. Um, of the five platforms, three emerged from uh, in-depth workshops done in conjunction with Doblin. Uh, Doblin, as you may know, is an innovation company. Its CEO is Larry Keeley. And um, we've gotten to know Larry very well. So as we began to uh, think about what areas we wanted to devote our resources to, we had workshops in three areas that systematically led us to conclude that the wellness experience, number one, the prediction and prevention experience, number two, and the Mayo Clinic Connection experience number three, three of our platforms, were based on their analytics and the workshops, appropriate areas to devote our attention and resources to. The second criteria was that they were all consistent and aligned with the Mayo Clinic strategic plan. And, and even uh, now, as it turns out, as the strategic plan is being refined, and with our new CEO, John Noseworthy, having led a 2020 vision exercise, there are even more appropriate areas of our attention. There were two other platforms that emerged largely um, because of uh, our appreciation that our responsibility in the Center for Innovation included uh, disseminating information throughout the organization about the discipline of innovation. Uh, to enable as many people as possible in the organization uh, to, to, to innovate. So that led to the development of the competency and culture innovation platform. Um, the last platform, which is the Mayo Destination Experience, was in fact in some ways an extension and a refinement of some of the work that we began with the institution in the Department of Medicine um, where the objective is to make the visit of every patient that comes through a portal to Mayo a memorable um, uh, and unique and positive experience.